Apollo's Fire's Messiah was one of the most exciting messiahs that I've ever done. It was the first one that I felt in a while that it was really fresh and new and um, it felt like that all the performances that we did, like every single time we did it. It was filled with a passion that I hadn't experienced before and the choir was smaller and every sort of working part seemed to go, seemed to fit in beautifully with each other. I try to choose musicians for Apollo's Fire who are highly expressive and Many of us have worked together for a long time so that we've become kind of like a family. from the 17th and 18th centuries all talk about affect, the idea that music has the power to move the emotions. Well, the storytelling is, is, is the essential aspect of this and, and um, in a way, everything we all do all the time. Uh, I, I make it a practice of reading the whole libretto of every piece I do, uh, often paying more attention to, to the solos, the airs, the, even the backstory, if you will. Oh, he's like I got started young in a choir, so I performed it as a, as a kid. Um, and I sang my first solo in Messiah as a boy alto. And even then, it seemed like just magic. No matter how many times you hear it, for me, it, it has never really gotten old. I've always enjoyed Messiah, be it in the audience or be it performing. If at the end of two hours, if we've managed to bring a tear to someone's eye or make someone laugh, then we feel that we've done a good night's work. Yeah.